Hello, my name is Josie Patterson. I'm a local youth artist and activist, and I want to unpave paradise. Project Watershed has been raising funds for Couscous Sum since 2017, and will be responsible for restoring the property once it is purchased. The most common question is, what about soil contamination? Well, Project Watershed did their homework and found out that the site has a certificate of compliance, which means it has been remediated. As part of the remediation process, a third party environmental assessment firm was brought in. They dug a bunch of holes into the property. They tested the water and traced any contaminants back to the original building or activity that was the source. Loads of soil were then trucked to Swan Hills, Alberta to be remediated. Thanks, Alberta. They then filled the holes with clean soil. They did this till the water being tested came back clean, which means the levels were low enough that the water was deemed fit for aquatic use. This is the highest standard you can meet. And back when the testing was done, the standard was even higher than it is today. Project Watershed is expecting to dig up all kinds of things, old machines, tires, etc. Almost anything that took up space could be used for fill back then. However, they are not expecting to find any major soil contamination. Another reason for this is the site is influenced by tides, floods, and river flow. Any contaminants left in the site may have been washed away by now. Now, if there are any contaminants left in the site, don't we want to properly dispose of them before they leach into the river? Yes, so we added a contingency into the restoration budget to deal with possible contamination. In addition, the City of Courtney, who will be joint owners of the property, has access to funding for remediating sites like this. And if major contamination is found, Interfor, the company who currently owns the land, will be on the hook. Soil contamination is not a reason to forego this project. In fact, if there is contamination found, which seems unlikely, it's just another reason to unpave paradise at Couscous Sound.